Well, we've all heard that age-old phrase, something old, something new, something borrowed, something blue. Now, this week at more than 100 brides will get something free, not borrowed. Jiao Jiao Shen has the story. Yeah, well, we all know how expensive those wedding dresses can be from a few hundred dollars to a few thousand dollars. Well, you're about to meet some deserving ladies who did not spend a penny. Oh, Kelly, I like that one. Like every blushing bride-to-be, Kelly first can't resist any wedding gown. Oh, that is pretty. We are getting married in April and been planning since November. He um, proposed on Thanksgiving. And perhaps like many future brides, Kelly has limited participation from her fiancé. It's been, you know, tough doing it since he's been overseas. His name is Sergeant Paul Hutchinson of the U.S. Marine Corps. He's in Afghanistan on his fourth deployment. The proudest mom, yes, very proud. He's, he's done a good job. This weekend, in remembrance of September 11th, that brought us together as a nation, and it still is 10 years later. Belle Vogue Bridal is giving away more than 100 designer gowns to military women, whether they're serving overseas. I'm deploying very soon. Or back here at home. I think it's really, it says a lot. It says a lot, especially about what they stand for. For senior airman Tracy Brown, she came in with doubts. Thank you, ma'am. And walked out with a dress. For nothing. Zero dollars. A reminder that people do care. And I felt honored that they would do something like that for someone expecting nothing in return. Organizers say, we're just so happy for all they do for us. This is just a way that Belvo can contribute to them. Because whether they've been engaged for almost a year or just two Two seconds, every bride deserves to look stunning in white. And this is the first year Belle Vogue has held this event. It does continue tomorrow. For more information, check out NBCActionNews.com. Look under Lifestyle. In the studio, Jaja Shen, NBC Action News. Very